as you know, marijuana is now legal in California. So I've been smoking it. And I don't even feel like I want to smoke it. In fact, I'm like, I was like, earlier I thought, well, pot's legal. Guess I should smoke it. I don't want to. Twice I thought that. And then I smoked the joint. And I'm pretty stoned. But I'm also very inspired because I'm thinking about 3D printing oil, particularly how simplistic it is and how I think sometimes when people hear about stuff like that, they're like, it's too easy. Can't Maybe they, it's a disbelief because it's too easy or it's like they want a challenge in life. Like that's too simple. That would answer all our problems. But it's supposed to be that way. We make technologies that fix everything. The idea is we all get on the same page. The Arabs, those that practice ISIS, the idea of statism in direct correlation to adverse military pressure, i.e. they are jumping back from the wall. We pushed them against. The whole corruption in the Middle East of the last 13 years has been caused them to cause people to just be like, fuck this. Islam says that when the earth shakes and the world's about to end, you have to fight. You all come together. And as a unit, you can defend, you can win against all odds. They don't want to fight. None of them want to fight. But when you're up against the forces of evil, when you're being, you know, people around, I mean, imagine guys, girls, people who live in the United States or whoever the fuck, whatever city or country you're living in right now, imagine, and I don't want to think negative, but imagine if there were bombs dropping. I mean, have you ever heard the earth shake? I was in New York City uptown and they launched dynamite to blow up a building. The whole earth shook. And that was horrifying. It was, it was not pleasant. It was it was definitely something that if you haven't experienced it, you know, you got to imagine what these people are going through. <sighs> so we end the aggression all as a unit and focus on 3D printing houses throughout the world so the refugees can go home. Three D printing houses has gotten so cheap. I know that a year ago in China they printed like a, a two story villa in two weeks or something, three days or something. I don't know, something crazy. They bring the printer. Well, you can bring the printer to the location, or you can print the pieces and ship them to the location and then construct it on site. Shipping container houses, amazing looking, high tech for dirt cheap. That's like a global effort. I also think Congress should be passing laws onto the internet so that the population can vote on them over a 30 day, 10 day, seven day. Depending on uh, how important the, the vote is, but I think that the votes should go online, and then over the course of time, people vote on that, those. Everyone in the United States, everyone in the country, everyone in the world, if you want to do global initiatives. Yeah, the technology's there, it's that easy. It's supposed to be like this 